Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, James Sweeney, on a beautiful post Thanksgiving Friday afternoon right here at the New York Stock Exchange. I'm feeling full, I'm feeling awake, and best of all, I feel great because it's an abbreviated trading day here. So the market's there about to close. I'm ready to go home and hopefully no one is getting trampled at stores right now because it's Black Friday. In other words, it's time for a special post holiday early Friday happy hour closing bell here in the Big Apple. U.S. stocks trading mostly lower this Friday, right behind me, weighed down by a decline in shares of Disney and lower oil prices. This has investors also taken preliminary Black Friday shopping results. Now, as a quick reminder, U.S. markets, they were closed yesterday for Thanksgiving. Now, the U.S. stock market today closing at 1 p.m. We also have the bond market closing at 2 p.m., while gold and oil settle an hour early at 12.30 and 1.30 p.m. respectively. Now, there's no major economic data or earnings due out today, but all focus is on retail because it's Black Friday. And some early results already in. Target saying that Black Friday weekend shopping got off with a very good start with, in their own words, unprecedented results on Target.com and a strong turnout at stores on Thanksgiving Day. Meanwhile, Asian stocks having somewhat, somewhat of an effect, ending lower for the week, led by a decline in Chinese stocks after China's Securities Regulatory Commission launching invest, began launching investigations into local brokerages to crack down on short selling and speculation. The Shanghai Composite down nearly 5.5% today. That's its worst performance since August 25th, and it's also its worst week since the one ending on August 28th. And when you combine all of that, you have yourself a session right behind me now where about three stocks have declined for every two advancers. Let's take a look to see how the markets have shaped out to close out not only this trading session, but week as well. And on the corporate front, once again, all attention is on retailers as Black Friday preliminary numbers continue to be released. And with that stated kickback, relax, grab yourself a drink, and have yourself a safe holiday weekend here in the United States. Don't spend too much money, don't gain too much weight, and see you all on Monday as the holiday season has officially begun. For ModernWallStreet.com, I'm James Swinney.